Good morning and welcome to a fabulous colour, if you can see it. Welcome to Sunday. How are you doing? Hope you're having some great shaves. Had a great week and are in good health. Um, I've got a two new razors to use um, and, well, a few new soaps. But this shave is going to be um, a soap I've not used before, this particular one. I've used the brand and in different ways. I'll show you now. Uh, but this razor, I'm going to use this razor today. I love this razor, if you can see it properly. The lighting's right again. This is, um, now I was corrected. I've used this before you've seen if you follow me. In, and I've named it as a Gillette Long Comb. Gillette New, new type Long Comb razor. It's not a long comb. It's a short comb. Uh, there is a difference. The, this is the short version. The longer version, if you can see this curve here, is a longer, just slightly longer curve. So this is the short comb. So thanks for the correction. In my last video I used this in. Um, it's brass and copper. I absolutely love As soon as I seen this, I fell in love with it. Uh, very kindly sent it again. Made in the USA. Three piece, non-adjustable. Um, head heavy. Copper uh, top, brass base plate, a uh, bit of brass there, and a copper hollow handle. Very nice. Slight overhang, not as bad as some. Um, as I said, I've used it before, lovely razor. So it's a Gillette new type short comb. Um, using a Super Iridium, or Iridium Super, brand new, double wrapped, lovely blade. Um, that razor comes in this box, by the way, with, with that Gillette thin blade. Beautiful, isn't it? Um, soap. Now, I've used Erasmic. I've got the black tub, the old version. This is a new line. It's probably the same soap, rebranded, I don't know. Um, this is a shave stick. I've used their shave cream in this version. Um, and this here is brand new. So we'll see. So it comes exactly like that. Usually there's a plastic piece here, but it's not a lovely scent. Uh, so I'm just gonna huge thing. I'm gonna wet this and we're gonna go for this. I'll just wet the face. Well the whiskers. It's still quite warm here. As in uh, muggy, we've had a couple of lightning, very, very little storm. And lightning with no thunder, it's just a, uh, in what, one night it was sort of lightning, no thunder, and then the other morning there was lightning and a slight bit of thunder. Not here interested in that. So I'll just dip this in the water. I like this type of shave, proper, proper shaving. So how are you doing? What are you up to today then? What are you up to this weekend? Anything nice? We've had a big, um, well, a couple of big events in Wales this last uh, couple of weeks. There's been the, the Royal Welsh Show first and then the, uh, called the National Eisteddfod in a place called Llanroost, very near to Mrs. H's hometown. That should do, right. That's the soap, we can also go back to that. Now brush, let me just rinse very slick soap. The brush of choice today is a grey dog, spectacular. It's a um, boar and badger mix, let me just, boar and badger mix, and these beautiful wooden cut handles. That's a bone badger mix. Quite a heavy, heavy weight. So let me go now. Mm. That's a nice knot to think bone badger, lovely and soft.
And the reason I'm using it, well, because I wanted to, plus it's it's good, it's a good latherer with hard soaps. Look at that. Yeah, so we've had some quite a uh, that's a nice soap that. Nice and nothing uh, major in the scent, it's just a sort of a standard soap soap scent, but it's quite pleasant. So we'll heat the razor up, clean the neck off, and we shall proceed with a Sunday shave. Here we go, first pass. Gillette new type short comb. Feels a nice blade. Oh, that was in it. was the. Do you know what it is? Is this sparkling off the sun? That's uh, starting to aerate quite quick there. And there's a good application of soap. But I won't judge it too quickly. That's a nice razor. Very smooth blade, doesn't feel aggressive. Um, sort of a uh, sort of mid aggression, mild to mid. Um, the blade, brand new. Good slickness on that soap though. Yeah. Try to rinse that. Wet the hands. That's nice, first pass. So there's a, oh. Any news have we got? Anything on the, uh, nothing much. The tomatoes are still going. Um, I've had one. There's nothing red as yet, but there's a lot starting, a lot growing. So I've been tying them up and feeding them and that sort of stuff. Um, here we go. Oh, it's gone? Good grief. I'll tell you what, let me just, just added a touch of water to that. I'm just gonna lather it off the stick. The old brush, doesn't half it. <laughs> Takes the lather for you, except, it accepts it. Drinks it. I can hear a click in. This is how my grandfather and my dad used to do it a lot. That's more like it. If you're using a badger, ball brush or a mix, it'll uh, need a good bit of soap. Very nice. Like I say, yeah, just a standard century. But I like these, uh, even though I'm lucky enough to have good quality high-end soaps, 
but I've always appreciated the standard. But it's a very airy lather. I've added a lot of soap really, and it's still quite airy. So, and it's quite thick. If you wet it, it's, um, but I'll try a wetter lather, but it, it'll thin it out. But see how it's dissipating across the growth. But there's enough slickness in the uh, soap to not to worry and to carry on really. Yeah, it's very, um, it's not a good, it's not a creamy lather. But very slick. It's like that translucent one I used. Excuse me a minute. Good grief. Sorry about that, I could hear a like a crackling sound and it's coming from this lamp. I use a it's a light, whether there's an insect in there or something, I don't know, the batteries, so I've turned it off. <laughs> Sorry about that. You can't say these videos are not different. There's always something happening. <laughs> I'm sure things come alive for these videos. Right. So, so far, easy to lather. Excellent slickness. Centre standard. Lather is rubbish. Very airy. For the amount of soap I'm using, there should be enough in this. So I'm just going to wet it. So you've seen a thick application where it's had any water and this is the wetter. Gorgeous brush. That's more than enough. I mean it's good enough to shave. I mean that looks nice now, we we'll see how long it lasts. And as you can see there there's plenty, plenty in the brush. So here we go against the growth. It's a um, lovely blade, very smooth. Um, It's a mild to mid aggression. Right, just bear with me a minute. I'm just gonna, shouldn't show you that. I've just taken a battery to hold battery. Can you hear something in that? Maybe not. That's I can't work it out. It's definitely coming from that. Anyway, shaving, not a tech review. See how it dissipates. Don't know how it looks on camera, but uh, yeah, mild to mid aggression the blade. And it feels very nice in this. 
Uh, the razor itself for me is a sort of mild to mid aggression. Yeah, sort of mild, just under mid. With this type of blade, with this blade. I could, that could change this if I used a feather, I could say, no, it's, it's an aggressive, uh, well, it's not an aggressive razor, it'd be an aggressive feel to the shave. The, um, wow, that's nice. Yeah, it's, um, really slick. Soap feeling standard, as I say, standard scent. Um, I like it, Rasmic too, because the other, the old one has a nice scent. It's sort of the same, but it's a bit nicer for me. The cream, the shave cream, is lovely of this. Uh, if I had a choice, I would uh, go with the shave cream. It's, that's nice, nice creamy. It could be my water, because sometimes water can make a difference. Not often it happens for me, uh, whether water um, hampers the soap. It's very good usually, but um, it can happen. But uh, if I had to put money on it, I'd say it's the soap. That's not as uh, lather lasting, shall we say? But nonetheless, very enjoyable. Right, you know what time it is now? It's light clicking. Three, two, one. Pick up time, baby. The batteries have actually gone on these, so maybe that's one of them packing up. Maybe it didn't explode, but um. Very nice pickup time. There's more than enough in there. I wish I could put this to the camera, you could have a try of it. Beautiful. Just to show you, save waste in this. Yeah, really like this. Good old days, eh? Good old days. And the sad reality you can almost guarantee you'll never see Gillette going back to this type of stuff um, they may one day do a double-edged razor of some sort or get one made for them in China or whatever, India, Germany or whatever but um, as a special edition or special thing but I doubt they'll ever go into production with them because They'd be bankrupt, nobody'd need another razor after you bought one of these. <laughs> so that's why they don't bother. That's uh... Just a touch. So what are you shaving with today? Anything special? Is it the Sunday special shave or... If you're working, many thanks your service um, dinner Sunday dinner I bet you're thinking oh, you haven't mentioned it are you not bothered maybe Sunday let me just rinse with cold water and I'll tell you
that's nice. And I'm gonna leave it wet. I'm gonna use the alum. Hello, alum. Yeah, hiya. So, um, yeah, what are we using? What are we using? What are we eating? <laughs> something different today. Uh, I fancied something different. So, what I'm doing, I'm steaming some asparagus. And I'm also steaming two fillets of salmon. And I'm also steaming some Pembrokeshire new potatoes. And then what I'm going to do is steamed asparagus on the plate first, a layer. I will put the steamed salmon on top, new potatoes surrounding it. And I will put a creamy watercress sauce on top of the salmon, lashentos of on top of the salmon. And then eat as you so desire. Very nice that. I haven't had it for a long time. Especially the creamy watercress sauce. That's beautiful. Cold water rinse again. Yard for dinner. In. You may have guessed, but I enjoy cooking. Very much. I find it relaxing, therapeutic. Some people find it stressful, but not me. I found a good few things in life as I get older. I used to hate shaving. I love it now. I found the right way to do it and I found it's a passion, it's a hobby, it's an addiction, whatever. <laughs> but uh, no, it's a nice, I love it and I love cooking and it's nice then that you find things in life what you enjoy. And... Right, what are we going to use now? English leather. English leather is a spray. I've used it before. Nice scent. It's an old scent that. Let's make sure the whole right <laughs> spray in my mouth. Cut. Oh, beautiful. And the thing, my ladies, I don't know if some do it now, but my grandmother, she just reminded me then the spray, she used to do that with her, with her eyes shut. You do that, she'd do this, and for some reason she'd always do that and rub her wrist again. <laughs> You may know. It's a funny old thing stick in your head. Well, in this head, it's like a colander usually. But... And then we're going to head for Freshwood Boots Freshwood Aftershave Balm. So, very uh, inexpensive shave, maybe apart from that. Um, that, especially that dear stuff these days. And I'm not sure how much that costs, but um, priceless to me. It's beautiful, very special. There we go. Probably way too much. Oh, that's a nice scent. Very Nivea esque. There we go. So I love you and leave you. And many thanks again, as always, for your company, for the chat. Um, I hope you're having a good week, as I say, good weekend, and some great shaves, and uh, some new things, new ideas, whatever. Um, as I said before, I'm going to do a my filming equipment video, only be quick, uh, but don't watch it, you know, if you're not interested in cameras and tech stuff, I understand, don't feel, oh, he's put a video up, I better watch it. If you're not interested, don't watch it. It's only there for people that are interested in that sort of stuff or considering starting their own channels, you know, on um, shaving. And if these videos are any inspiration to anyone, whether it's de shaving, um, any type of wet shaving, or in fact making their own videos themselves, um, that's fantastic, you know. If you want to do something, do it. Uh, don't worry how you look, how you sound. I mean, look at me. Do I worry? No. And I'm still here. <laughs> but uh, no, it's, it's good. It's good. And that's it. So we've used the Gillette. I'll let you go in a minute. 
the Gillette new type new bar some people call it uh, short comb three-piece non-adjustable razor beautiful thing made in the USA brass and copper um, the razor itself is a sort of mild to mid aggression uh, with that blade it's very smooth very efficient uh, and it's, it's a mild to mid aggression on the blade the soap easy to lather there's a lot of it I used a lot great lather uh, great to quick to lather good slickness a standard scent rubbish uh, lather doesn't last it aerates and dissipates but you can still shave okay with it, it just doesn't on camera it doesn't look as good um, but it's doable uh, what else have we used we've used the grey dog badger and ball brush mix not beautiful thing uh, that works really well we've then rinsed oh, with the super iridium blade brand new that was nice as I said rinse with cold water we used alum now we've used English leather cologne spray lovely scent very old-fashioned takes me back and then um, put the moisture freshwood by boots freshwood balm so that's lovely many thanks again for your company have a great Sunday and uh, some even better shaves and a great start to next week stay healthy stay happy and stay positive if you can in this mad world and I'll see you on Wednesday for the midweek shave take care